Hello all. Let's do some more examples of division. This time we're going to use larger divisors. Let's start with this example. What is 520 divided by 65? Start on the hundreds. There's one more digit in the dividend. Set up our dividend and divide. We'll only look at the first number. 6 goes into 52 8 times. 8 times 6, 48. Now we have to multiply 8 times 5 as well. 8 times 5 is 40. And our quotient, 8. Two thousand ninety three divided by twenty three. Two more digits in the dividend, one, two. Set up our dividend and divide. Two goes into two once, but really this is two point three. So I'd better try this instead. Two point three into twenty. Uh, 10 is too much. Let's try 9. Multiply and subtract. 9 times 2, 18. 9 times 3, 27. 2 goes into 2 once. And we're okay now. 2.3 into 2.3 once. 1 times 2 is 2. 1 times 3 is 3. And our quotient, 91. Seven point one one divided by seven point nine. Start on the hundreds. Zero di one digit, one digit, so I don't need to move. Set up the dividends and divide. Mm, seven goes into seven once, but really seven point nine, so that's not gonna work. Seventy one. Well, this is almost eight. And this is almost 72, so I think 8 goes into 72 9 times. 9. Now I multiply and subtract. 9 times 7, 63. 63. 9 times 9, 81. And it worked. Our quotient, 0 0.9. 17,000 divided by 34. 5 versus 2, 3 more digits, 1, 2, 3. Set up our dividend and divide. 3 goes into 15, 5 times. 5 times 3, 15. 5 times 4, 20. We're done. Our quotient, 500. 64,600 divided by 380. Start on the hundreds. 5 versus 3 digits. So I go 1, 2 to the left. Set up the dividend and divide. Well, 3 goes into 6 twice, but really it's 3.8. So 2 is too much. 1. 1 times 3, 3. 1 times 8, 8. 3.8 into 26. Well, 4 goes into 27. 4 goes into 28 7 times. So I'll try 7. 7 times 3, 21. 7 times 8, 56. And that was correct. Our quotient, 170. What is 0 0.5084 divided by 82? Start on the hundreds, zero digits, two digits. There's two fewer digits in the dividend. I'm going to go one, two to the right. Set up the dividend 
and divide. 8 goes into 50 6 times. 6 times 8, 48. 48. 6 times 2, 12. 8 goes into 16 twice. 2 times 8, 16. 2 times 2, 4. Our quotient, 0 0.0062. Three point five six nine six divided by ninety two. Start on the hundreds. There's one fewer digit in the dividend. So we go one to the right. Set up our dividend and divide. Nine goes into thirty five three times. Three times nine, twenty seven. Three times two. 92 into 8, 8 times. 8 times 9, 72. 72. 8 times 2, 16. 9 goes into 73, 8 times. 8 times 9, 72. 8 times 2, 16. Our quotient, 0 0.0388. What is 3,859 divided by 0 0.17? Start on the hundreds. Four digits versus zero digits. Four more digits in the dividend. One, two, three, four. Set up our dividend. 3, 8, 5, 9, and divide. 7, 1 goes into 3, 3 times, but really it's 1.7, right? So I think only twice. 2 times 1, 2. 2 times 7, 14. 1.7 into 4, twice. 2 times 1, 2. 2 times 7, 14. How many times does 1.7 go into 11? 6 times. 6 times 1 is 6. 6 times 7 is 42. Now we can back up. 1 goes into 1 once. Actually, it's 1.7 into 1.7. Same as before. Even though I already put a number here, I can still put a 1 and go just like I would before. I just added 1, so 1 times 1 is 1. 1 times 7 is 7. Our quotient, 22,700. Eight hundred forty four thousand two hundred eighty four. Start on the hundreds. Six digits versus three digits. There's three more digits in the dividend. One, two, three. I'll set up our dividend. Eight four four two eight four and divide. Eight goes into eight once, but see it's really eight point seven. So that's not going to work. How about 8.7 into 84? Nine times. Nine times 8? 72. Nine times 7? 63. 63. Nine times 4? 36. 36. 8.7 into 57. Well, 8 goes into 56 seven times, but I think that'll be too much. So I'm going to say 6. 
6 times 8, 48. 48. 6 times 7, 42. 6 times 4, 24. 8 into 52, 6 times. 6 times 8, 48. 6 times 7, 42. And 6 times 4, 24. We got it. A quotient, 966. One more example. What is 81,704 divided by 2,918? Five digits versus four digits. So we're going to go one to the left. Set up our dividend, 81704, and divide. Hmm. Two goes into eight four times, but it's really 2.9, isn't it? So I think just twice. Two times two, four. Two times nine, 18. Two times one, two. And two times eight, 16. How many times does 2.9 go into 23? Hmm. Well, 3 goes into 21 7 times. So I think we'll say 7. 7 times 2, 14. 7 times 9, 63. 7 times 1, 7. 7 times 8, 56. Now, how many times does 2 go into 2? Well, if you look, you can see it's 2918. So really, it'll divide perfectly. 1. 1 times 2 is 2. 1 times 9 is 9. 1 times 1 is 1. And 1 times 8 is 8. We got it. Our quotient, 28. Now, you have to do as many of these problems as you can. The more you do, the quicker, the easier, the more intuition you'll get. So keep practicing and you should be able to divide any number into any other number now. Nice work. Thank you.